Hi you guys, it's Sunday, it's my day off. My buns are firmly planted in the sunshine. I'm so excited about it. So I've had this topic on my brain for like a week and uh, I've tried to record it a couple times but didn't go how I wanted. So I'm gonna try it again right now because I think it's really important and it's something that really keeps <laughs> coming up for me. You can probably hear the kids playing in the background. They're adorable, hold on, let me, let me show you what's going on. <laughs> So cute. So, anyways, the the topic the topic that's coming up, and this this has been coming up for me I, for years, literally. But um, it's about making yourself a priority and being selfish in a good way. I know selfish sounds bad, but it's really not. It's about taking care of yourself. So I know that women, especially, like we're nurturers, we're caregivers. Like we just we take care of our people, right? We take care of our friends and our family and and our kids. And um, what happens is we end up putting ourselves like last on the totem pole. We make ourselves a low priority and um, we don't take care of ourselves and then we end up getting like really resentful. We let people cross our boundaries and we start to just feel really shitty, right? Because we're not taking care of our body. We're not taking care of like our emotional health, our mental health. And um, we end up not being as much of service as we could, right? Like when I look back at all the times that I thought I was being so giving and like selfless and like giving all of myself, those are the times that I was the most freaking miserable and you know resentful towards other people and um, just not really leading my life in a positive way that was empowering to others or even really helpful to others and I found that the way to be the most helpful to others and to be the most giving to others is you have to give to yourself first like right like put on your own oxygen oh she just did a backflip that was awesome um, put on your own oxygen mask first right before you help somebody else so I just feel like it's something that we often forget I know men men are um, I do know some men that are guilty of this too where it's just like giving 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 all the time and you forget to give to yourself and you end up becoming like depleted and exhausted and um, just not feeling very good and, and you know the more that you can light yourself up and become lighter and brighter the more that you can offer that energy um, to other people so that's just my big message is like even if it's like 5, 10, 15 minutes of just like self-care like me, like just chilling out in the sun, I freaking love doing this, you know, so whether it's like taking a bath or like reading a book or meditation or yoga or dance or whatever it is that lights you up, um, writing, whatever it is that lights you up, it's so freaking important to do that so that you can stay in balance and you can be better at giving service to others because really if you truly want to be a giving person and you want to do it in a really fucking awesome way then you have to give to yourself first. It's so so true. So that's that's my little message to you today. I hope you're also enjoying your day and uh, I'll catch you guys next time. You can see more on tiffanyjolly.com. You can grab your free copy of uh, Omnia Yoga. It's the jam. Perfect example of self-care. So check it out and uh, I'll catch you guys next time. Bye.